Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, your girl, Leah Lee, and today I am in my spa. I am going to let you guys know all the details about the products that I use in my bag bar, the products that I may recommend for at-home treatments as well. So as you can see, this is my two shelves of my bag bar. And let's go ahead and get into this video. So you guys already know for the most part, if y'all watch my treatment videos, if you follow me on Instagram, all that awesome stuff that <clears throat> I use Image Skincare. Um, this is the company that I started out with in my spa. And prior to actually buying into the company for this back bar, I had no previous experience with the skincare line. So everything is self-taught um, on how to basically construct the best facials for my clients. With the Image Skincare, I do have the bottle c line some things from the ormetic line i have my sunscreens down here this is the one i use more predominantly um it's the prevention daily matte moisturizer and i just like this one and i'm more comfortable with this one especially on my um darker skin clients this one i haven't really got into this is the daily hydrating moisturizer and it's only 30 SPF, but that's good as well. I need to get into using this one. It, even if I just use it on myself or my fair skin clients, I need to get in the, the motions of using this one as well. Um, I do have some peels with Image. I have the Acne Lift. This is a gel peel. I also have the Ormetic Lift. This is the Lightning Lift Forte peel. The Forte, the only difference from this one, from the original image peel on um, the image lightning lift peel is that this one is a little bit stronger than the original peel i also have the advanced vha peel i have the signature facelift this is for my um, more mature skin clients that you know need that tightening of their skin um, boost of collagen all of that for the wrinkles and etc and then i also have the perfection lift forte peel now, I know you're probably like, dang, girl, you got a whole lot of pills, and I really do. Mind you, I was, you know, a very, very new esthetician. I really didn't know how much back bar I would need, so I kind of did splurge on the pills, not having all the knowledge that I do now. If I knew now what I knew then, I probably would have started off with only like two or three pills not the six that i have i think it's six one two three four five six yeah so that's just way too many especially because i don't i don't perform them that often um and then this is the eye peel degreasing prep solution that i use uh pretty often in my videos with microderm or um before a chemical peel i do also have the max line with image this is for once again that um more mature skin even sometimes textured skin can benefit definitely from this line um, because the ingredients are a little bit more active in this line versus the other lines um i know you guys have seen the cell clear line i talk about the salicylic gel cleanser a lot this is definitely a line this is my go-to product for my acne clients yeah, that's the that's another clear cell product. This is the Mac, the medicated acne lotion. I've used this a good amount of times as well. And I'm gonna pick this. I think I'm, this is gonna be the last thing that I talk about from Image, other than the Illuma product. So I have the O2 facial kit, which is from Image as well. This line is predominantly surrounded by the fact of oxygen and supplying oxygen and supplying the skin with oxygen that um, it may be depleted from, um, just giving the skin a nice, bright, glowy facial. And this tinted moisturizer sunscreen, oh my goodness, this is like my best friend right now. It only does work on a certain shade of color, like color skin. 
because if this is for like a too too fair person it's going to look like too brown too bronze on them so i don't really use this on them someone that's like my complexion or even a teeny teeny shade browner this works perfect on especially in the daytime of course it's the only time i really apply sunscreen my client and then lastly my illuma products i talk about this brightening exfoliating powder so often in my last treatment video i was talking about this love it you guys this is the i have like basically the whole line of the aluma brightening products the cleanser the um serums the creams the eye treatment all of that and so that's a wrap pretty much on image i have these products from image which I really don't use much so image did come out with image skincare pro and that's these two products right here this is the pre extraction emulsion and I use this from time to time when I feel like the client's skin may be a little tough or um, some the extractions may be like a little bit tougher to extract I definitely put this on the skin after the enzyme or in, in the in the case of an enzyme because it does have like a little tingle to it um, and with some steam. But um, you're supposed to remove it before starting the extractions and not exceed 10 minutes of this being on the skin. The next product is the microderm exfoliator. This is supposed to be like a substitute for microderm. I don't really care for this product for me to be doing it on clients. Maybe if this was like a product that they would do at home, something that they can actually be in the shower with because it does have like these little beads in it and it is just the most frustrating product to try to remove on a person that is laying down. And I have tried using like the tiniest amount of this product and it still is like there. The, the beads don't really dissolve. So, you know, it's constantly like beads, beads, beads. And either, even after once I'm like finished with this step of the, the facial, these are still around during the rest of the facial and that is so annoying so i don't really use this product much but this one i do use it um, every now and again going on you guys we are going to be talking about skin script we love skin script don't we i'm gonna to have to fix this all back to how it was but skin script these these are the first products that i actually purchased from skin script and it was for my valentine's day facials uh, specials or whatever so this is the cherry enzyme and the dark chocolate mint mask and these I talk about these so much in the treatment videos because these were the only products that I had from the line now I did recently just purchase the professional kit and as well as the retail kit like the samples so I have all of these right here beside these image products Y'all, when I tell you everything is right here, everything is right here from the entire line outside of their chemical peels. My favorite cleanser from Skin Script right now, two of them because I use them kind of like a double cleanse type situation, is the green tea cleanser and the glycolic cleanser. Y'all, I might have to order that glycolic cleanser for myself. Skin Script is also known for their glycolic and retinol pads to help with uneven tone, um, to help with acneic skin, hyperpigmentation, all of that. So that they don't actually give you like a pad. They, they more so give you the, the serum, the liquid that the pads are like saturated in. So I haven't tried that yet just because I, I wanna use it like in the most profitable way for the client. Um, so I haven't really dabbed into all of it. I've also used the, the retinol 2% exfoliating scrub which I think is really good, really, really good, really bomb. And I've had some clients even tell me that they've started peeling afterwards. Um, like once they've left out, a couple days has passed and they're at home. So that's telling me off the bat that the product is working, the product is effective. And that's one reason why I did decide to purchase some products into uh, Skin Script because I wanted to try out something different, something that gave me more of a punch in the terms of skincare and um, effectiveness. So the cherry enzyme we know is for um, hyperpigmentation, acne skin as well. And it gives some moisture and some hydration back into the skin. And this dark chocolate mint mask also gives a ton of moisture. Moving up to my second shelf, I do have Lyra Clinical. 
so so excited to have the skincare line i've heard a lot of amazing things from fellow estheticians spa owners um, and I've heard the effectiveness and the ingredients in these products. The results have been amazing for them and their clients. So I'm excited to use this. I literally just got these products in, so I haven't had the chance to actually use them on anyone um, as of right now. The products that I did buy into are for acneic skin for the most part and hyperpigmentation because that is really the bulk of my clientele. So I definitely have been searching for the perfect, the almost perfect products for their skin. Um, so those I'm super excited to use. I have the ice line, which is definitely for the hyperpigmentation and acne. Um, so this is the balancing lotion. This is the pro line, which is the C4 retinol serum. Once again, this is the ice clarifying treatment. So once again, this is for the acneic skin. Up here, I have the salicylic cleanser, the bioenzyme cleanser. So I'm sure this is gonna help break down any skin, that any dead skin that is on the surface and needs to be exfoliated away, as well as the pro exfoliating cleanser. And right here, I have a pH solution. These, all these products for the most part, I was going over Lyra Clinical's um, protocols and facial protocols on their website so i kind of pieced together like what i would need for a, a full facial and that's how i decided on what products i purchased this is also the pro light serum so of course we all know that it's going to help to brighten the skin and up here we have the ice refining mask as well as the illuminating polisher y'all i'm so excited to start using these products it was very very tempting to not to use these products on myself but i'm not gonna do it not going to do it and i mean like on myself full blown at home i definitely am going to try these products out on myself but not like in my home i'm gonna try them out in here right here we do have some peter thomas roth i love peter thomas roth line i use the uh the glycolic anti-aging cleanser at home um, these are the gold products. I'm, I'm running a special right now for St. Patrick's Day. Um, basically like a gold facial. And this is the gold mask, which is always known. No, gold is known for to be like a serious antioxidant. Um, helps the skin replenish itself, rebuild itself, and protect against harmful outside um, properties. And then, then up here we have some hydrogel iPads that are also gold. Moving on, we have some Dermalogica. I use Dermalogica's pre-cleanse as well as their multi-active toner. And then we have some Numb Masters. This I got from Amazon. This is, I'm going to start doing microneedling soon. So this is a numbing cream that I will apply before actually beginning the process. Here I have my Dermaplane Pro Dermaplane Scalpels. So these are using, getting used when I do um, a Dermaplane facial. And then lastly, you guys, I have the candy brow tint, um, eyebrow tint. So that's going to wrap up this video. I hope everybody understands now what I use in my spa. If you have any questions pertaining to any lines, any lines that you see here or even that you don't see here, y'all let me know and I'll try to help y'all out as much as I can. Thank you so much and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye guys. The wax that I use is Star Pill, and I use the blue wax and also the coral wax. The, the wax is okay. I don't service a lot of wax clients, um, but I am looking into a wax that um, is a lot more effective in removing the hairs, whether it's eyebrow, whether it's underarm, um, wherever on the body in more of a like quicker way. Um, just because I don't have the best success with this wax, um, I have to go over like eyebrows a couple different times. Um, so this is what I use for the pre and post service as well as the Esthemax Hydro Jelly Mask. I know y'all see these all the time in my treatment videos, but for some reason I forgot to mention it in this video. I use the Super Green Strength Spot Diminishing ALA and the Beta Carotene Floral Mask.